Greetings, everybody. It's the Doctor. Welcome back to more Star Trek Online. We are continuing the new Romulan mystery missions that Cryptic has introduced in the fifth anniversary of Star Trek Online. Completely revamped and re redone the Romulan mystery storyline. So now we're going to start with Desperate Measures. I do believe that this mission is a combination of two previous missions that were under the Romulan mystery, and they've kind of combined them together and melded it into one story. So let's see how that turned out. The Romulan Empire is experimenting with Boric technology in an attempt to regain their former power. They must be stopped before they attract the attention of the Collective. Hail. The leaders of the Romulan Empire have been blinded by their ambition to salvage what remains of their empire. In their blindness, they have begun to meddle with forces beyond their control. During the incident of Agrama, you uncovered a message from the Herogen indicating that they delivered a Borg sphere to the Romulans. Even more troubling was that some of the Romulan ship debris from Vulcan showed signs of being modified with Borg technology. Our allies in the Romulan Republic have shared information regarding a failed attempt by the Tal Shiar to study and adapt Borg technology. The Tal Shiar crew that boarded the cube came to a disastrous end. Unfortunately, a Romulan agent was able to destroy it before it could fully reactivate. We cannot afford another incident like this. Long range scans indicate that the Tal Shiar have the Borg sphere they got from the Herogen in the Pilatus system. You must travel there and destroy it. After it is neutralized, see if you can find a way to track any Borg technology the Romulans may have salvaged from it. Even a small device could prove devastating in the wrong hands. Go to the Pilatus system, which is in the Alpha Centauri sector block, and find the Borg sphere that the Romulans are studying. Scuttle the sphere and then attempt to track down the, the Borg technology. We will get, and this is the mission where we get the prototype Gravitic Modulation Impulse Engine, so if you are leveling up and you're a commander at this point, having these engines are really nice on your ship. As you can see, they increase your flight speed, your flight turn rate, and your impulse flight speed. So these are really, really nice engines to have at commander level of the game as you play, as you're leveling a character. So. Uh, I just want to say it looks like what I thought was the Romulan sphere in the vault is not that. The ones that the Herogen helped them get seems to be this one that we're going to go scuttle, which I do remember that mission, you know, previously before they have merged these together. So I do remember this mission now. And uh, this is not that sphere. So when I said in the last mission that the Herogen helped him get the sphere, and that's the one in the vault, no, apparently not. The one that the Herogen helped him with is this one we're going to go take care of right now. So, what the heck? Did I not take the mission? No, I did. Maybe there's some lag. All right, go to the Pilatus star system solar system way back here Okay, here we go. Empress Sila. Captain, we have the Borg Sphere on sensors. This is not in Empress Sila. This is Desperate Measures. I think they have some titling wrong there. <laughs> Captain, we have the Borg Sphere on sensors. There are multiple Romulan patrols in the area, sir. We will need to deal with them before we can scuttle the sphere. Engage Romulan patrols. Ratios and set a course. So this is different maybe a little bit warning ship is under attack target shield has failed
Our shield is failing. Okay, there we go. Dealt with that. Scan the sphere. I'm not picking up any signs of Romulan ships, and there are no life signs on the sphere. Recommend we destroy it. Okay, easily taken care of. Captain, our top priority should be to find any technology or research the Romulans have salvaged already. There is a Romulan communications satellite in this area. If we program it to transmit an emergency signal, the Romulans will send a ship here to investigate. We can hide behind that asteroid. If we run minimal power, the mineral content in it should disrupt sensor range. Once that patrol vessel arrives, we can use a reconfigured Class II probe to essentially tag the Romulan ship. Even if they cloak, we'll be able to follow the probe's energy signature. If there is a base anywhere in this region, we'll find it. Okay, sounds like a plan, I suppose. Of course, I could also just cloak. Well, I don't really even need to hide. I can just cloak. <laughs> but I guess we need to hide. See, they need to give options for people that can cloak like this. Because that's all we need to do. But let's hide. Wait for the ship. Alright, a Romulan vessel is coming to investigate. Observe Romulan ship. I'm observing. They've tagged the vessel. We can follow them. I want to fly through this donut because it looks so tasty. All right. The ship has gone to warp, sir. Based on telemetry from the probe, I believe they are traveling to the Gasco system. There's a small colony on a space station there. Laying on a course to Gasco. We have arrived in the Gasco. Scans confirm Boric technology on the station. They have detected us. They are launching several ships and they have activated their defenses. Well, that was fast. That escalated quickly. We have we have the element of surprise on our side for the moment, but they... Are... No, we don't. Okay. Contradicting. They have detected us. They are launching ships and they have activated their defenses. And then it says, we have the element of surprise <laughs> on our side for the moment. No, you don't. It says they've detected us. Did somebody not, like, double-check the content of this text? Because, come on. That's a glaring mistake right there. Um, okay, whatever. Recommend we eliminate resistance. Why, eliminating resistance is what I'm best at. Ship is under attack. Shield 
That's the way to do it. Fire at will on all of everything. <laughs> We got our full bridge officer team. Excellent. Sir, we've arrived at Gasco Station. The station is on high alert. We should expect heavy resistance. Normally, Starfleet attempts to resolve conflicts peacefully, but in this case, the security of the quadrant requires an armed response. We should interrogate any scientists we find along the way to determine where the Borg... Wow, interrogate them, huh? Okay... Well, let's do this one here. She's very scared. We haven't even done anything yet. Or he. He or she or somebody. Starfleet? What are you doing here? Well, we traced Borg technology back to the station. That's all. We intend to destroy it. Have a nice day. Really? I sympathize. That Borg technology is creepy. We all hate it, but we don't have any choice but to work for the tall Shi'ar. They're holding my sister hostage to make sure I behave, and she's not the only one. I guess I gotta rescue your sister. You might need help yourself in a minute or two. Your transport was detected, and the station is on high alert. Security forces are already on their way. You don't have a chance. Um, Promise she'll try to yeah, help my sister, and I'll unlock all the doors and turbo lifts for you. There, she's near the medical bay. Good luck, and don't forget my sister. Fine, we'll help her. She's by the medical bay, huh? I think they redesigned this station, maybe. I think this is a new station design. Current and modern. Gasco colonist. Three turrets. So I guess you're just going to stay there. This is not the medical bay. Who are you? You! Are you from Starfleet? I have no love for the Tal Shiar, but I do have a family. If I complete my work, the Tal Shiar will guarantee our safety. Oh, let me guess. I gotta rescue your family, too. Most of the families are being held in the medical lab. You will need to cross the engineering level to get there. Be careful. Some of what they're working on there is quite dangerous. Any use of board technology is dangerous. You're talking about devices designed to regenerate damage, replicate themselves, and assimilate anything they can reach. If we had a breaching containment, we could lose the station and everyone in it. Okay, well, it looks like I'm saving everybody's family in this mission. Take turbo lift engineering. Well, wait one second. What's over here? Absolutely nothing. Okay. Enemy targets on sensor. Personal shield losing power.
My guys are cleaning house. Let's just go around the room and make sure we've cleared out the enemy before we go down there. Saving a lot of colonists, I guess. Access research logs, so I don't want to miss that either. Oh, these are colonists. They're fine. Ooh, this is a Borg thing. That is for sure. They are messing with things they shouldn't be messing with. Oh, those are Borg engines. Look at that. They're modifying Borg engines on a shuttle, just like you can get the console or the uh, Borg set. They're messing with all that. That's neat to see that in action. All right, research logs. Okay, we've got research log one, two, and three. Head researcher log supplemental. The Herogen upheld their end of the bargain and delivered a disabled Borg sphere to the Palatus system. As a precaution, we have not moved the sphere from that location. I do not want to risk powering any systems that might trigger the Borg's regeneration protocols. However, I do feel it is safe to begin dismantling and analyzing the sphere's components. The Borg technology shows great promise. I believe we will be able to improve our weapons and shield technology well within the Empress's timeline. Work to integrate Borg components into our vessels has begun. So far, the process is proceeding as expected. We have increased the combat capabilities of our ships by upwards of 30%, and I still feel like we are barely scratching the surface. There is so much about the Borg technology I do not understand. Some of my researchers have expressed concerns over the risks of experimenting with this technology. I explained that circumstances beyond our control control force force us to take extreme measures. I suspect they may continue to have misgivings, but they no longer share them with me. I now share my staff's misgivings about this line of research. Incorpor incorporating Borg technology into our ships is one thing, but this Commander Navak has taken over our medical bay and is experimenting with incorporating Borg technology into our citizens. Anybody that expresses discontent with the program either disappears or finds their family being held hostage to ensure their cooperation. We should have never sided with the Tal Shiar, and now it's too late. Alright, destroy Borg research. There's a Borg engine component thing that I am destroying. What was? There we go. Oh, it might have, perhaps, should have warned me that it's going to explode before I do it. I could have, like, backed away or something. No, just explode right in front of my face. No problem with that at all. Take turbo lift to medical bay. Let's go save everybody's family. She's hard to kill. But ultimately, she went down. All right, unlock cells. All right, well, here's everybody we just saved. Excellent. 
I can't even begin to express my gratitude. Tequila! I'm from Serini Prime, one of the colonies that is still neutral in the conflict between the Republic and the Tal Shiar. Before all this, I was a vocal proponent for the Republic. All I can think is that I attracted the wrong kind of attention for my outspoken beliefs. Her name is Tequila. I am not making that up. That's what it is. One day I went for a walk on the cliffs near my settlement. I remember seeing something strange and hearing a metallic buzzing. Then everything went black. I woke up in this cell. No one will tell me where I am or why I'm here. What they do say is that I'm a test subject. They're planning on implanting me with Borg technology. Oh, no. I didn't think anyone could be so callous. Not even the tall she are. We'll get you home. And I think she mentioned uh, metallic things. I think that's maybe an allusion to the Alachi or... Um, yeah, the Alachi, I think. We saw that on the Romulan faction as we played that. So I think that they're trying to allude to that now to get the Federation side, you know, familiar with that, with that enemy. Which is nice. Okay, they're all beamed up. Is there a cell over here? It looks, I thought there was, no. That's just a glowing loot thing I want. This is Admiral Ensign Ricky. Just wanted to let you know your brother is safe and aboard our ship. Thank you so much. Now, allow me to assist you. These access codes will wipe our computer core, destroying all of our data. No one will be able to replicate what we've done here without that information. Excellent. Well, let's do that then. Why didn't you do that before? Purge. Uh, uh Upsilon. <laughs> Upsilon Beta? Is that supposed to be Epsilon? 241. Beam up? Is that it? We're done? Because that was easy. Oh, no, we're not. Sir, the Romulans are activating their assimilated ships. We have to destroy them. If we fire weapons at one of them, it will come online faster, but I think I can del delay their activation if we get close enough to send a command sequence. Oh. Okay. Oh, I'm like right here on top of it, in fact. Warning. Ship is under attack. I can just destroy them, I think. Really not that difficult to destroy. I mean, I've got a pretty good ship. So I'm just gonna go and kill them all. on you once more, would you be willing to take me to my colony? I must deliver a report on what's happened to our ruling council, and I'd really like to see my family again. It would be our pleasure, Tequila. I guess we're just gonna do that between missions, apparently. thought we were actually physically gonna go there, but the mission's over now, so I guess that's it then. Reports. I have forwarded your mission reports and the recovered data to Starfleet Intelligence. We now know that the Romulans have been researching Borg technology and that they were willing to risk a war with the Federation to advance their goals. 
There is a 76% chance that Starfleet will have to take actions against the Romulans to prevent them from continuing with this research. If that occurs, I predict that we will need you and the crew of the Tom Baker to assist in averting calamity. You have done well, Admiral. Live long and prosper. Excellent. So that's another one in the bank. Awesome. I am liking the new, I guess, revamped missions here under Romulan Mystery. Desperate Measures was definitely a mission that was there previously, and they just kind of beefed it up a little, which is nice. They needed to have that one in there because the whole integrating Romulan or Borg technology is a big part of the uh, Romulan plot and everything, so that was good. So, so far, Impressila, thumbs up. Desperate Measures, thumbs up. Now it's time to get to the next one, which is Shadow Play, and that will be in the next video. So thank you for watching and stay tuned.